Feeling trapped down on the floor I don't know what for Feels like I'm gonna lose Silence takes a hold I can't let it go Chain up, no one knows But I won't let the stormy seas Throw me an open water Let me have my peace And leave me till tomorrow Wind into my sail Away from things I let go Floating on the waves We go bottoms up We go all the way When you're feeling down Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope y'all are having a great day so far. So today's video is an extreme whole house clean with me. So I'm going to be taking you along with me as I get about just my entire house clean. There is a ton and I mean a ton of laundry motivation and I know most of us could use that. I know I personally need a laundry motivation on a regular basis, but I'm also going to be cleaning up just some real life messes and getting my home back in order. I hope this video provides you guys with a ton of cleaning motivation and that you're able to tackle something on your to-do list right along with me. But before we get too far into the video, be sure to give this one a thumbs up and also hit that red subscribe button down below if you haven't already. I would love to have you join my little YouTube fam. Okay, so we're going to start off in my bedroom. I just wanted to make my bed and wipe everything down. As you saw in the beginning of this video, this room was a complete wreck and I really needed to get it under control. So I'm going to wipe all the surfaces down and then we're going to start on that laundry. Okay, so before I start in on that laundry, I wanted to let you guys know that today's video is a collab with my friend here on YouTube. Her name is Kristen from the channel Love Kristen. She shares a ton of cleaning motivation and all things homemaking over on her channel. I love all of her cooking videos and meal prep videos. Her channel is just super, super motivating and I love watching her videos so I know you guys will as well. She's also going to be doing a whole house clean with me so make sure you head over to her channel when you're done here and check it out. I'll have all of her links down in my description box. Make sure you watch her video, subscribe to her channel, show her all the love and let her know that I sent you. So I've shared this on my channel before but when I have a ton of laundry that needs to be folded here I have like four loads of laundry and you're about to see me bring in another load I like to sort it by person or by like towel so I have a pile for both of my boys a pile for me a pile for my husband and then a pile of towels it just makes it so much easier for me when I can sort the clothes out and then fold them by person and put them away it just seems to be not as overwhelming for me if that makes any sense so that's a tip that I have for you guys if you are like me and you let clothes sit in a laundry basket for way way too long then just sort it by person and fold it that way just so it's not too overwhelming for you
So if you're coming over from Kristen channel or you're just new around here, I wanted to say welcome and thank you so, so much for deciding to click on my video and hanging out with me for just a little bit today. I really enjoy making, cleaning and organizing motivational content for you guys to give you an extra boost of energy to get through the day. I know we all have a never ending to-do list and we need some motivation to tackle it sometimes. And it also helps hold me accountable because I will let things slide like my laundry here for far too long and making content for you guys really does motivate me to get it all done. I really hope that you decide to hit that subscribe button down below before you leave and join my little YouTube fam because I would love to have you here for all of my future uploads. So I hope by now y'all are motivated to fold that basket of laundry that's been sitting there for far too long because you guys, I thought I was never going to get through all of this laundry. It took me forever, but I was so glad when it was done and I'm also going to put it right away. I'm very guilty of putting clothes in a basket like this for the boys and then never actually putting it into their dresser and then it just gets all unfolded when I'm looking for stuff. So I decided I was going to put it away right after I was unfolding it so that that didn't happen this time. I can feel you mm. Once you've seen all the things, all the places I hope it means that you'll come home to me Once you've traveled the world, all the spaces inside your heart And now we're moving into the master bathroom and this is a whole hot mess as well. I'm so bad at not putting my things away when I'm done using it. And I always say I need to get better at putting my things away, but let's be real. I'm probably never going to be good at that, but at least I will have content for you guys in the future. Just 
don't want this night to end Yeah, about time we stop pretending Come home with me Let's write a history Tonight I'll make a scene It's all about us It's all about us As we're dancing close together Making out It's all about us So it's been a while since I've come into Brayden's room and really cleaned it up. As you can tell, he has toys everywhere, all under his bed, under his nightstand. It's just another room that's a hot mess in my house. So I'm going to get it cleaned up today. I really do need to come in here soon and just go through all of his toys and reorganize them and get rid of the ones that he's not playing with. But that's not going to happen in this video. I'm just going to be putting everything away. I need it to dust in here really badly because you can kind of see in this clip right here all of the dust flying you know when the sun shines in just perfectly you can see every dust particle ever so obviously I need, I need it to dust in here super bad so I'm gonna do that as well So now we're on to the very next day. I don't know about you guys, but I can never get my whole house clean in one day. I used to be able to just bust it out, but unless the kids are out of the house, there's no possible way that I'm getting the entire house clean in one day. But now we're on to the second day, like I said, and we're gonna start off with the dishes because I had a ton of dishes in my sink. And if I'm being honest, it was starting to kind of smell bad. We had made a crab soup the night before and I didn't do the dishes, so it kind of just, it really stunk and I needed to take care of it ASAP.
Would you fall with me? No matter how deep it goes With my head underwater So if you're still here watching, I wanted to say first, thank you for sticking through this video with me. I know it's kind of hard sometimes to watch an entire cleaning video all the way through, but I do appreciate it. And I also would love to know what you guys are up to today. What is one thing that you need to tackle on your to-do list? Let me know down in the comments. So like I mentioned, we had made crab soup the night before and it was super late so I didn't clean anything up and my stove is definitely showing that. It's a complete disaster so I'm going to go ahead and clean it off. The first thing I'm going to use is the um, Windex multi-surface spray just to wipe it down and get all of the crumbs away and then I'm going to go back in with the Dawn Power Wash and a scrub and just scrub it all off and get it nice and clean. So earlier this week I posted a video of me reorganizing some of my kitchen cabinets and in this box right here is all the stuff that I took out of my cabinets that I want to keep so I'm going to store that someplace else and I did pull out all of those Dollar Tree bins because I am going to be organizing underneath my kitchen sink in this video just a couple minutes you'll see that and I wanted to pull out all of those organizers to see what I wanted to use under there. Um, I was planning on doing a part two to my 
kitchen organizational video but i think i'm just going to add in all of the new stuff that i do into cleaning videos in the future because that video that was dedicated to organizing didn't do super well on my channel so i'm just going to stick to mainly cleaning i think and moving forward i'll just include the organizing inside of cleaning videos so as i was going through all of my cleaning products i noticed that some of my refillable products were running kind of low so i wanted to just refill them while i was decluttering and reorganizing underneath of there and there are links down in my description box if you want to try either of these products it's the jaws cleaners and the branch basic cleaners So my goal for underneath of my kitchen sink was just to make things way more easier for me to grab and to find. So I put all of my most used products in that little turntable so that I can get them very easily when I need them and find what I need. And I'm going to put all of the other cleaners that I do want to keep but I don't grab for on a regular basis into that wicker basket and put it into the back of the cabinet. So if I want something, I know where it's at very easily and I could just pull it out and get it.
the very last room that we're going to be tackling in this video is my living room. And I just wanted to really quickly get it all picked up, fix the cushions on the couch and the pillows, even though they're going to be thrown on the ground in like five seconds because the boys are currently eating lunch at this point. So once they're done, this room will be a disaster again, but it does feel nice to have it clean for just a couple minutes. I needed to refill the diaper drawer and I also wanted to straighten up the hutch a little bit and then fold some blankets. And that's basically it in here. We're going to vacuum also. I did plan on mopping just about the entire house today, but I didn't get to it and that's okay. But still I dream of you and say your name in my sleep Tell me isn't that crazy Just wanna call you up and tell you how I feel I see you wherever I go And you don't even know You are the stranger in the corner on the second floor You're the girl next door Okay, you guys, so that's going to do it for this video. Thank you so, so much for hanging out with me for a little bit today. And I really hope this video gave you all of the cleaning motivation that you were searching for and that you were able to tackle everything that's on your to-do list. Before you leave, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button down below if you're new around here. I would love to have you join my little YouTube fam. And also, don't forget to check out the links in my description box and go check out Kristen's video. You're going to love her and make sure you let her know that I sent you. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll catch you all in my next video. Bye, guys. Yeah, are you awake? Wish I could call you. I'm gonna call you. You are the stranger in the corner.